Good morning, Nuggets. It's your favorite TT from Divine Me 1111 Spiritual Guidance. I hope you all are doing well. Um, happy birthday, Pisces. We're going to get into your energies for this week. Um, if you need to get in contact with me for a personal, that information is in the description box. Pisces, you have the opportunity to book a $10, 30-minute reading with me. So um, go ahead and hit up the the inbox or well yeah the inbox on any of the platforms of course but um, you can email me at platinum touch 1111 at gmail through um, YouTube okay yeah it's been it's been interesting um, the channel song that I got is um, I stand alone by God Smack. And right now, Pisces, I think that's that's kind of your energy is just, you know, you and God doing your thug fizzle until further notice. Um it's not a I don't think this is an arrogance standing alone, pushing away, but this is a determination of I've got to get this done. I've got to get myself on track and get myself in a space where um, I'm doing what's best for me. Um, Pisces, you kind of feels like a, a kind of like a, a withdrawal or a pullback from um, a lot of a lot of energies. So. We're gonna take that as it resonates and we're gonna get into it. Let's go on and pull the cards, okay? We're gonna start with a TT's music oracle and see what see what God has for us, alright? Alright, let's see. Okay, so we have like I'll Never See You Again by Alicia Keys. So this is, um, if you know the song, this is about, you know, giving your all all the way up until the last minute um, and, you know, really being present because tomorrow is not promised. So it's possible that the channel song of standing alone is you I'm gonna be honest nuggets um, this could be you know someone you, that you love transitioning or they have transitioned and you are in the awareness that it's you know it's just you and you have to you know be in this mind space of okay it's just me and I gotta do what I gotta do to take care of myself okay um, dang that kind of put a, a not a damper on the energy but kind of a like holy shit I, I'm, I'm in this by myself I gotta do this on my own and standing on your own two feet okay it's not bad it's not bad because the thing is is as long as you as long as you've got god as long as you are in the space of you know it's me and divine for a little bit it's not a bad place to be nuggets it's not a bad place to be because when you have god on your side Ain't nothing in this world that can, can come against you. All right. Let's see what else God has for us. Cause I know that's not the end. I know it's not the end. many angels many guides and a lot of help in the spirit realm and that energy being in the spirit realm 
a lot of the times can be more powerful than what's going on here and well all the time is more powerful than what's going on in the in the natural world so um speak up use your voice when when you need when it it needs to be because god's got you you just have to open up your mouth and ask no more sitting in um you know sitting in the energy of being in your feelings and not communicating it say what you need to say say what you need to say what's that who is that uh john mayer say what you need to say for some it could be you know the words might not be so nice they may be you know some ugly words but um, as long as you are in your highest heart of love and it is not your intention to um, be in an energy of malice and BS, you know, say what needs to be said for your peace. Because again, you know, whose peace are you keeping if you are um holding back your what you need to say to you know for other people's peace and not yours and you you're holding on to words that you need to say and need to express right all right yeah yeah you've been holding on to some stuff and it's you know new moon said or full new moon Full moon said, okay, there's no more of that. Full moon says there's no more of that. There's no more being in the energy of um, saying one thing and feeling another. Both are going to be in alignment. Um, I'm Every time I get this hyena card, I hear the song Backstabbers by the OJs. It's a lot of fuckery going on that's coming to an end okay it's coming to an end Pisces and the thing is is you're gonna have to be the one to put it to an end all right this is this this to me is calling people on their shit and good goodness I know Pisces are not ones for confrontation but it is what it is this week nuggets we are doing what it is to be done for our peace so that we can grow and get to the next level because the thing is is everything you want is on the other side of um, hesitation and fear yep seeing things for what it for what they are and acting accordingly looking at you know the things that have been sown um, not holding on to grudges we're not holding grudges we're saying what needs to be said and then moving on from it um, now whether or not the you know the situation comes along with you the person comes along with you that is up to them but what's important is seeing things and not overthinking it seeing it for what it is communicating it from a space of love and then letting God do the rest. You know, you putting your head down, getting to work, and letting God do the rest. Okay? Let's see. This is all about heart healing and speaking things from your heart. Not being trapped in the energy of, you know, busy work and, you know having your mind in 50 million places at once this is you know doing what's best for you thinking higher thoughts of yourself and your situation and putting into practice the healing that you've gone through these past couple of weeks past couple of days maybe okay But it's also putting in the work. 
putting in the work to heal, putting in the work to um, grow out of a situation that's holding you stuck and stagnant and needing to uh, be addressed, untangling, you know, the, the mind. You know, proving to yourself that you can achieve the impossible. And that's healing. It is not impossible to heal things that have happened. There's, it's not impossible to, you know, speak your truth and things be um, in a positive, end up in a positive way. You're, this could be you, you know, thinking things are going to um, end up in a negative way when in all actuality it's the energy that you put into it so if you if you wanted to be a positive situation pray over it speak to it um, ask God to give it to you from a place of truth and vulnerability it's not it's, vulnerability is not a bad word Pisces um, I'm hearing grow up. <laughs> I'm talking to me too, y'all. I promise I'm talking to me too. All right. Yeah, so you can begin anew so that you can be the master of your own, your, you know, your own life. You can speak things and think things into your own existence but it's up to you to, you know, get the, the foolishness and the negative thoughts out of your own mind. This is, you know, walking into a new level of success, whatever that is for you, walking into a new level of, you know, being encouraged. Woo! Yep. Clean and a and an absolute one hundred percent clean slate. Uh, I am hearing um, Prince until the end of time. I'll be there for you. Come on, y'all, adore. This is you being in the energy of loving yourself truly, loving every part of you to the level of love that God loves you. Isn't that awesome? Being in the space of this is your truth, this is your honesty, this is uh, this is my truth, this is my honesty, this is how I live, this is how I express myself, this is how I love. And then just being in that joyously, I'm hearing joy. Um, what is that? Who is that? Is that Black Street that sings that song? Um, and then I'm hearing you light up my life. Okay, so, um, this is possibly you coming into, um, a relationship and someone speaking truly and honestly with you and you guys starting, you know, starting, you know, something new and, or, or leveling up. I'm hearing, uh, I was, my mind is saying Shakira, but I know that's not that lady's name. Um, Sierra, that's her name. Now, y'all take Shakira how y'all, <laughs> y'all take Shakira how y'all want to, but I know this, I know it's Sierra, bless her heart. All right. So, I'm going to take this like this. Yeah, this is you having, you know, built a, a solid foundation for yourself and still, um, still going for more, you know, knowing your worth, knowing your, your value and what you've built on but taking it to another level and being offered something more than what is, um, what's in your present environment, okay? And 
having a choice. This is having a choice. You're being given a choice. And it's going to, you know, it's it's gonna be it's you gonna you're gonna have to let some shit go in order to um in order for this to, to get to the next level. You have to let go of some 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 stuff that possibly is generational maybe and seeing it for what it is allowing things to be illuminated to you and come to light after this bs has fallen off and knowing that in your highest level of peace love and authenticity god has got your back and this is this is something that god's bringing into your awareness bringing in for you Good goodness, Pisces. It looks really good. It's it's the beginning of something beautiful for you. It is just time that you claim it, that you walk in it, that you um, be your own mo your own motivation for it. And you know, hey, who's to say that it's not going to be some sort of miracle that comes out of the sky that you didn't even see coming and it just um i'm hearing washes everything away but it's not even a washing away it is um an elevation of your understanding an elevation of um your awareness and who you are okay so um the let's see the only sign that i am seeing here for you right now pisces is um is leo so take that as it resonates it's, you know leo energy is the energy of love and home and peace and you know relationships and the heart this is heart healing um, letting things go for heart healing so be encouraged know that you know the things that were toiling and you know had you all up in your head and in a whirl and had you going in circles by the you know you got me going in circles we coming off of that wheel and it's being enlightened to us that we can come off of that wheel and uh, break generational curses and cycles of um, lack consciousness and just build. The world is your oyster. You have the power to manifest and create what it is that you want, that you need, that you um, desire in your life. The thing is getting past the um, getting past the things that are not yours. And allowing God to burn all of that stuff off and allowing it to be placed where it needs to be placed. Okay, Pisces? So, that is your message. I love you all. I love you from my soul. And I send you all blessings and light. Take care.